I think the most important thing is that it, we, we can rebuild the credibility of this inquiry. And I think Theresa May needs to do that because we've had four months now of the chaos and confusion and really the mess surrounding something which is so important both for the survivors of abuse who want answers to why institutions failed to protect them uh, and what, whether things were covered up, but also for everyone and for the important recommendations that we need for child protection in the future. So I think Theresa May needs to do something that she's failed to do repeatedly throughout this, which is to meet with survivors of abuse, to talk to them, to set up a proper survivors forum to support this inquiry and to get it going on the right basis with the right credibility in place. It doesn't have to be somebody with child protection protection experience. We've seen successful inquiries before into sensitive issues. For example, the Hillsborough panel that was led by the Bishop of Liverpool, or for example, the Soham inquiry led by Sir Michael Bichard. So you can have people from a range of different backgrounds who could do this kind of inquiry, but the most important thing is that they do have the confidence and they have worked with and listened to survivors as part of this. And that's something that the Home Secretary has just failed to do repeatedly throughout it. And I think that's that's why it's really gone so badly off the rails.